everyone, welcome to my channel, it's Jen Sims, and today I have another Sims 4 video for you guys. A few weeks ago on Instagram, I asked if anyone would be interested in doing a collab with me, and if you saw my video last week, you already know that some people did. So we ended up going with a decades theme, so each of us chose a different decade and built a house in a design style that was popular during the decade that we chose. So if you have not seen my last video, I will leave a link to that down below. It doesn't really matter which order you watch them in, but I would recommend that you check them both out. And the first build in this video is a 1950s mid-century modern home built by Amusing Ingenue. Her Instagram is at Amusing Ingenue, and her YouTube is also Amusing Ingenue, so that makes it really easy to find her. And I hate to be biased, but I was really excited about this build because mid-century modern is one of my favorite build styles. She actually based her build off of a real life house called the Kaufman Desert House and it is absolutely massive. This house ended up being five bedrooms and four bathrooms and it is only one story. It has a living room, dining room, kitchen, office, master bedroom, and bathroom. Two smaller bedrooms with a shared bathroom, an area for a maid or butler to live, and a garage. If you have all of the packs that she used to build this house, I highly recommend placing it in your game and exploring it because there is so much to see, and I think this build would be perfect to have in your game for a big family in Oasis Springs. The second house is a 20s art deco house built by me. My Instagram is at jensims, and if you're watching this, I don't think I need to tell you how to find my YouTube channel. I've always liked the art deco style, but I've actually never built a house like this before. This build ended up being one bedroom and two bathrooms, so it is definitely the smallest build in this collab. The living room, kitchen, dining room, and one of the bathrooms are on the first floor, and the bedroom, another bathroom, and two outdoor living areas are on the second floor. All of the black and gold was giving me Great Gatsby vibes, and the red flowers and checkered floors were giving me Queen of Hearts from Alice in Wonderland vibes. Overall, I was happy with how this build turned out, and I think it would be cool to have in your game for maybe a fashion designer or an actress sim to live in. And the last but not least build in this video is a modern minimalist built by Nikki. Nikki's Instagram is at NikkiOnSims, and you can find her on YouTube at NikkiGames. This build is really cool and different from anything I've ever seen anyone build. I think the shape of the house and all the big windows that she used really made it look modern. This build ended up being two bedrooms and two bathrooms. On the first floor, there is a living room, dining room, and kitchen. On the second floor, there is one bedroom and one bathroom. On the third floor, there is another bedroom and bathroom with a play area. And on the fourth floor, there is a library. She also used custom content furniture and decorations, so she was able to add all of these cool touches, like the deer head outside and those big plants on the first floor, which I really like. Outside, she added some minimal landscaping, an outdoor seating area, and a pool. I think this build turned out looking really cool, and if you wanted to download the custom content that she used, I think this build would look really great in your game in either San Myshuno or Newcrest. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said in the last one, this collab was so much fun to do. I think everyone did such a great job on their builds, and I loved how they all turned out. Links to everyone's social media will be listed in the description, so be sure to go follow all of these talented people and go tell them how much you liked their builds. And before you go, leave a comment here about your favorite, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!